Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another video. Um, just another little custom black series one today. This one is a little bit more simpler than the uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi I did the video on last. Um, this is quite simple. Um, basically, this is getting a Luke Skywalker from The Mandalorian uh, season, finale, season 2 finale. Um, which still blows me away. Um, I, it's been a couple of weeks now since I've watched it again. Um, yeah, need, really need to go back and have a rewatch of the of the whole series, both seasons of The Mandalorian. Um, but yeah, I, I did have a couple of these Lukes um, back when they were released, so I thought I'd, you know, give one a little bit of an alternate look and, uh, you know, keep hold of my Return of the Jedi looking one and, uh, you know, whip one up for The Mandalorian shelf, seeing as he's become a part of that series now. Um, I do have him blue tacked down to the to the floor here. Um, so I will just pop that off just so it doesn't stick. So basically, pull back the hood. We're left with the, uh, it was a Walmart exclusive uh, back in 2019. And uh, I have given him a swap of hands. So he's got the black gloved hand. And I had a spare Bespin Luke um, that I took the belt from. I know it's not super accurate, um, but it works. It's got the pouches. Um, I did sort of slice off. I did slice off the holster and the bottom of that pouch. I think just so it looks like a simpler belt. Um, that actually took a bit, a little bit of work to get it up and over the legs. That was fine, but to get it up and over the uh, tunic here was a little bit of work. Um, just move that lightsaber out of the way. Uh, yeah, so I just I dunked, held it, put it under black, boiling hot water for a short moment, and, uh, and then I was able to just sort of quickly get it up, get it up over his thighs, and then you know, had it still had enough stretch just to sort of get over those edges that sort of stick out a little bit and uh, get it into place. So uh, it shouldn't be too difficult to remove if I decide to do so later on. And the cape came with the uh, Rise of Skywalker SH Figure Arts Kylo Ren. Um, because he does, does have the cape with the hood. Um, and the beautiful beautiful thing about this cape is it's, it's big um, and it's wired all the way around. So you can really get this thing to pose up exactly how you want it to. So you can get it, you know, the, you get the, the fall of the cape. You can get that sort of draping around the floor. So it's on a flat surface, and because it is with it, with a, was with a Kylo Ren, he's slightly taller than Luke, so it does have a little bit of fall, and uh, you know hits the floor around him a little bit more. So you can pose this up fantastically, um, and the hood itself is um, wide as well. Um, I did actually attach the strings across the neck there. I actually did that when I had it on Kylo Ren, just because it was a uh, it was a quite a little tight fit. There's a little um, that little flap there which I even tried to cut a little bit more of a hole in but that was just so sort it of sat over the neck joint of the Kylo um, but I'd like to sort of tighten that string up a little bit just so it sort of sits both these sort of corners here sit under his neck a little bit more maybe you're to the front um, and maybe pin it there tack it there with some with some thread um, so that sort of sits down a bit nicer but I think it looks all right. It's quite effective. Um, it's a really good quality cape. Um, and yeah, it uh, wasn't really required for the way I'm displaying displaying the Kylo Ren uh, figure at the moment. Um, so yeah, perfect, perfect for Luke. Um, but yeah, this is a this is a good Luke Skywalker. It's not the best. Um, not sure that it, it would still be classed as definitive, but it's pretty good. Um, I've seen a lot of folks uh, change the heads around, keeping the hair because the hair is really good uh, for Return of the Jedi. Um, but they've actually been able to remove that and change the change the head over. But I don't think it's too bad um, at all, really. And specifically because I'm going to be displaying him with the uh, hood up like this. Just the way that he made his super duper badass entry in the Mandalorian. But yeah, to be able to flex that sort of cape up around there, sort of have it trailing in behind in the wind and stuff, it's 
zoom out. Yeah, just quite an easy custom. I mean, there's there's capes and stuff out there. There's you know there's a whole market of customizers out there that are selling uh, awesome you know wired capes. I think Mudhorn Customs is in the UK. I think he's been doing some as well from memory. Um, yeah, there's literally so many resources out there to get wired capes, so you don't have to go and spend the the big money on the SH Figure Arts figure just to get the cape. Um, but yeah, I definitely recommend getting a hold of one because uh, yeah, it certainly makes this figure look sweet. And I, I, I didn't mind it. I had him with the brown cape for a little while. Um, didn't look bad. I was almost going to just dye it um, a, a really like dark, not quite black, but almost black. Um, but decided to go with this instead um, just to save a bit of trouble. But uh, yeah, you can sort of flex that down a little bit and bend it into shape, but I'll just leave it for the moment, leave it up to your imagination. So post Return of the Jedi Luke Skywalker, looks fantastic. What do you think in the comments? Drop, please drop a comment down there, uh, let me know what you think. Um, yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you've yet to subscribe to my channel, please do. I really do appreciate all the support. Um, yeah, I have some more videos, and I will be back live streaming this weekend. I just had the weekend off. Um, yeah, had a bit of a tough week, so I just needed to uh, just needed to take a weekend off just to just to recuperate a little bit and straight back into it this weekend. So, looking forward to hanging out online. I'll uh, put all the deets and stuff up on my social media. Um, you can join in. All right, folks. Thanks very much for watching. Till my next video. May the force be with you always. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get on it.